Now, your East Texas Storm Team forecast with Marcus Bagwell. We've had sunshine and very warm temperatures this afternoon. We were uh, close to record high temperatures into the lower 90s, but either way, we're talking temperatures that are well above the normal temperatures for this time of the year in April in the low 70s. These are the highs observed so far this afternoon, and you'll notice today that we have been into the upper 80s to lower 90s, as warm as 93 in Linden this afternoon, 90 in Jacksonville, Henderson and Gilmer, at 87, Mount Pleasant at 90, Tyler up to 89. We'll get the official numbers in just after 7 o'clock. It has also been very humid today. I did some cutting grass uh, earlier today, and it was just very muggy, even being outside from about 11 to 1 before the full-on sunshine took over. It has been a very humid day today. This is a look at top of the Fredonia Hotel. You notice those high serious clouds passing through. 85, and look at that dew point. A mess measure of the low level moisture it's in the mid 70s it is going to remain very muggy as we go through this evening as far as precipitation is concerned we have not seen any of that the real story has been the heat as temperatures are still into the mid and even a few upper 80s on live Doppler radar, for the most part, we have been quiet. However, we have been monitoring back near the dry line over central Texas for some store development, and we just really have not seen anything get going. So that chance for our southwestern counties is going lower and lower by each passing minute. So give it about another two or three hours, and that storm chance for you will be next to zero. For tomorrow, we are tracking some cooler weather. We have a cold front arriving in the morning. Look for temperatures to be into the low or 70s come tomorrow afternoon, we will see a few isolated showers that will be possible. But a heads up for Saturday, we're keeping an eye on the potential for a few strong to severe storms. Storm Prediction Center outlining a very broad area, but it does include East Texas under that risk for us to see some severe weather. We'll, of course, have to watch things very closely. Here's a preview on how Easter is expected to play out over the weekend. Friday, Good Friday is mainly dry. Saturday, storm chances, but then Sunday, Sunday afternoon, we should see the rain begin to let up and some decreasing clouds. That should allow us to have a nice second half of the Easter Sunday. Seven day forecast now for you. After this cooler weather comes in and that storm chance on Saturday, we get a reinforcing shot of colder air. That'll be coming in Monday. Look at highs next week in the 60s, overnight lows down into the 40s and maybe even some 30s by next Wednesday morning. Here's Deep East Texas. A couple of more showers for you for tomorrow. And that storm chance picks up come Saturday. Marcus, thank you. All right.